Greetings, suns and moons, and of course I have to welcome back all my stars. I'm being called to do another really quick reading, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. I've already called in my guidance, protection, coverage needed for me and for you. I just ask that you be. Make sure to check out those, um, the next three months readings, okay? Because I am a reader that resonate with spring being the actual true New Year, so you may not hear me talk about New Year's too much, but for those of you that believe in uh, New Year's or practice uh, New Year's rituals, <laughs> um, Happy New Year's to you, okay? So we have Pisces, the end of the road, okay? So that's that's indicating something coming up in the future. Some of you may have already experienced her a tower moment so this is about somebody's health or a belief about some children possibly a marriage okay pisces is the ruler of the 12th house okay it talks about secret enemies hidden enemies i heard conspiracy theories okay this is crossroads in crossroad energies again this is going to resonate different for everyone this is a timeless collective reading, but this is a faded situation. I'm hearing someone lacked accountability in the past. Well, look, we got fate and destiny. Look, my stars already know. On this channel, fate is the duality of destiny. Someone forego, for, 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 what's the word? They forego their mission here, okay? Out of ego and pride. All right. With precision, I feel like somebody is taking a risk. Some of you may be seeing a lot of number synchronicities. Remember to always add up the numbers. Some of you are in your left brain. OK, so you're very analytical, very logical. OK, um, you're following your intuition as well. You may be receiving messages from the spirit realm as well as from people in your past. So we have, yeah, Venus is retrograde. Okay, so yeah, v Venus is retrograde in Capricorn. Some of you may need to check your Lilith sign. There's some hidden information there, possibly about a Sagittarius or a Gemini. So let's see. Again, I encourage you to check out those free joint readings. Also, there's a link in the description box below where you can receive a free chart. All right, so this is about someone's stability. Someone wants to bring some sort of balance. Okay, I'm hearing domesticated. So this is going to resonate different for everyone. For some of you, this has something to do with a spiritual partnership. For some of you, it has something to do with an actual contract, something on paper, a long-term commitment with Capricorn being here, possibly with a Capricorn or a Leo, or someone needs to take a risk. Okay, look, we had a wheel of fortune, some more fate. Source wants it to be known. This is a faded situation. I'm also here a moment in time. There could have been a turning point. Okay, like uh, a reset. I'm also, I'm also hearing fifth house. Somebody needs to check their fifth house. You or this person could have fifth house in Pisces or Sagittarius. Okay, but somebody's learning to master some sort of craft. You're somebody that's very intellectual. Someone is very intuitive. Okay, you're you're you are a predecessor. That's what I'm hearing. This is causing someone some sort of tor uh, tormo. You're healing. This could have something to do with your child's father or the patriarch, a patriarch or someone's family. Okay, this could also be somebody that's very uh, a dictator. Okay, they they're very stern in their ways, very cutthroat. They're receiving some sort of karma with the will of fortune being uh, in the shadow. Okay. This person was very rebellious towards you. They could have been very argumentative. They could also lied on you, slandered you. They could have contracted someone to do some sort of sorcery to you, to your business, to your career. Why is mastery here? Some of you, you're dealing with somebody that has Aries or Taurus in the fifth house. Yeah, this could also have been a lover, a karmic uh, person here that you had a soul contract with that something that needed to be fulfilled this lifetime some of you need to realize if you are on a journey of ascension that means you have to clear up all karma karma from past lives as well some of you have multiple life here multiple lifetimes okay so somebody's definitely in hiding here okay 
I feel like somebody's in a dark night of the soul or in the middle of some sort of transformation. Somebody's definitely being guided. So this is somebody that's being guided through the underworld. That's what I'm hearing. Okay. So they're learning a lot of uh, hidden things about themselves by going within. This is somebody that refused to face their shadow for some of you. For others of you, this person may not um, choose or haven't choose the path of ascension. So they're they're in some sort of hiding here. Okay, this could be some some kind of warped view of thinking. With Mercury being here, this is also indication of an entanglement. This person could be entangled in their thoughts and their feelings and their emotions. Okay, due to some sort of rebellious activity that happened in the past or something that's coming up. Again, this could have something to do with the child's mother or the matriarch of a family. Uh, this is going to resonate with the last reading. Some sort of partnership, a dictator, someone that is married. This is also someone that believes they, uh, since they have some sort of power, authority, influence, money, that they could control people, be very manipulative. This could also be someone that owns their own business. I'm hearing a producer or some sort. I'm also hearing a CEO. Okay, so this person may have an alcohol problem or they do risky things when they drink. So you followed your intuition about this person. Some of you are in your strong uh, feminine energy. You're very cutthroat as, as someone, okay? You're very defensive about um, protecting your future here, okay? Some of you are astral traveling or someone is trying to astral travel to you. They're also doing some sort of psychic manipulation. This is something that's uh, in secret. They're trying to cause some sort of stagnation, some sort of lack, Okay, but I'm also hearing that it's pushing you forward. Pisces, I believe. I'm hearing I believe I can fly. So somebody's going to find out something about a past enemy. This could be a friend, family member. What is this? I believe somebody was also uh, going through some sort of transformation. I do feel like you healed. Okay, and when you healed, things started coming out, possibly about Someone that's immature or for some of you, a younger adult, someone that could be in their 20s or 30s, I'm hearing. Someone that's very insecure here. Someone that may, um, <laughs> they're picking any. So this is someone that believes that if they do everything that a man says, that is going to keep them or they're going to somehow want to stay with them. This is somebody that always wants to make themselves an option in someone's life. This is someone that doesn't care if someone is married. They're ego booster for karmic men is what I'm hearing. Young adult. The person could have had a child with this person. Yeah, somebody could be trying to set someone up to have a child. Keep that in mind. This emperor here, they could be finding out that a child is not theirs. Yeah, because they were enticed someone by someone that is a psychopath. This person or this um, emperor that this younger female seduced away is finding out that this person is a psychopath. They hold back emotion. They hold back um, emotions. This is somebody that's successful. But they're dishonest and they're very manipulative, okay? This is somebody that's very charming. They could also have a lot of children. This person could be experiencing some sort of health issues. Yeah, they take yeah they take people for granted here. This is um, a romance, love them and leave them type. You're just an option here. Again, I feel like this person has multiple families or multiple women that make themselves available to them because this is an emperor, a business owner, a CEO, or this is someone that may have married into some sort of money here, okay? So this is somebody that purposely goes after innocent or people that is very manipulative. Again, this is a dictator. They're receiving some sort of fate here with mastery here. This person was trying to master someone's life, uh, emotions here. New phone, who this? <laughs> so somebody definitely blocked someone. OK, or they may be finding out that they are not the master of somebody else's reality. They could have a God, a God complex. So find out the truth about your relationship. I feel like what comes around goes around. This uh, emperor, this dictator is receiving a lot of karma from a lot of different people. All right. They could also went to our, yeah, made some sort of contract with a high priestess in reverse. Make sure to check out. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 
Just make sure to check out the last reading. I'm hearing that this high priestess is no longer answering their phone for this person. Okay. So this person, this emperor is now doing, uh, yeah, spell work on this high priestess, somebody that they had a contract with, somebody that they thought they were getting um, genuine downloads from. Why is this Wheel of Fortune here? A Libra, a Libra could be involved or this person, whoever this high priestess is, they could be in the legal system or about to face some sort of justice here, especially if they were doing uh, stop court spells is what I'm hearing. The will of fortune. Somebody was trying hiding their true identity. They could also been having sex with multiple people. And I'm also hearing readers or somebody has sex with somebody has sex with a high priestess. Okay, whether they knew it or not, um, they definitely met their match with nourishment in reverse. Okay, so this is somebody <laughs> that they left you for is what I'm getting because this person had tempting offers. Well, let, let's get this bread. They could have offered themselves in, I'm, heard, I'm hearing in imaginable ways. Why is nourish in reverse? So this person could have married this person. But I'm hearing like it was some sort of scam. They married for something. Okay. It could be for a loan or something like that. With the high priest in reverse, they definitely met their match because this emperor is 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 evil. <laughs> so they did they 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 hooked up with someone that matches their energy. Okay. Well, my heart is beating for you. This person is now realizing that they are poison or that they they drunk the poison here. <laughs> I don't know why I heard Jim Jones. The emperor. Why is the emperor here? That's significant for somebody. Okay, yeah, they thought that this person was, I heard the bee's knees, honey. I don't know. But again, we have E equals MC uh, two square in reverse. So this person is very uh, explosive, argumentative, confrontational. Will I lose control of my emotion? This person blames everything on them or on you. Okay, so this is somebody that's very immature here. This is somebody that you told to kiss your ass. OK, this person may also, again, um, this. Wow. <laughs> I'm hearing that this person, um, this is somebody that may tell this person, you know, suck my. Are they like the way this person sucks like this person? Uh, yeah. Yeah, something about fellatio here. Somebody need to let this person go. They didn't. This person could have also uh, offered to give this person um, some fellatio here. They suckered them in. They could have also sold their phone and got some information off their phone. This is somebody that they were told to cut off. Okay. Again, yeah. There's a third party that got somebody's phone and did something to someone's phone here. They may have had, had to get a new phone. Okay, and then they found their old phone. Somebody's realizing they got some sort of uh, tracker on their phone with space being here. Travel hides behind a username. This is an imposter. This is somebody wearing a mask here. Okay, so either this emperor pretends to be someone else and they hide behind a username or the person that they are dealing with and or. Okay. Uh, yeah, this could be somebody that you cut off. For some of you, this is a distorted uh, masculine energy, a karmic uh, masculine from your past. Somebody that you had it's, uh, a lot of karma with. Okay, so it's something that you had to complete. You had to cut this person off. Look, the past. Okay, always know. Okay, so maybe in multiple lifetimes, you always uh, uh, were was rejected by this person. So you had to learn how to cut this person off. This person may have this. <laughs> I'm hearing this some sort of incant incantation spell. This is a warlock, a wizard type of dude. They did some sort of spell, uh, possibly in the past life, to bind you to them. And this is something that they obsessively do. This is why this person obsessively does this this lifetime, because this was a faded situation. This was something that was uh, destined to be. I'm hearing this person... Um, Never told you in multiple and past lifetimes. I'm also here misogynistic. Okay, they like women that they can control. Okay, this is yeah somebody that you know yeah they like aggressive. Look, look they like aggressiveness. They want to be able to like this is somebody that be like so much and then you yeah. This is how this person gets their gratification. 
They know that they are selfish. Okay. They're destructive here. They're a victim of their own deeds. But what have I done here? So this is somebody that you always, you always are going to say no to, or they have no uh, access to your energy. This person could have lied on you in court or they're getting lied on in court. Okay. Somebody is definitely watching somebody with hidden cameras. I don't know. Somebody got a new home and there was cameras in that home already. Okay. They thought they dodged a bullet here, but they were set up by whoever this fake high priestess is. Yeah. The, yeah. Look, you got the high priestess in reverse. I want y'all to see this. This is precise guidance, appropriate action, success, union, 7747. This person could have been involved in some sort of trafficking here. Okay, yeah. With justice in reverse, yeah, this person is involved in some sort of trafficking or trafficking, tracking. Okay, so yeah, this person, this high priest, did not pay attention to their feelings, okay? Which your feelings are valid. Ye or be yeeted, persistent man. Look, they're letting you know. Somebody didn't pay attention or they got some sort of false reading from a reader. Now the reader is not answering their phone here. Okay, so yeah, this reader, whoever they got precise guidance from, they they got bad vibes here. Okay, or there was, a, yeah, somebody made a contract. They exchanged some currency with a reader. This reader is very dark. They, I'm hearing this reader could also be a part of the witness protection program or is going to be or they're going to go to jail. Okay. Yeah. Trades, sexual, sexual favors for housing. So this is somebody that they could have let into their home, had a child with even. For some of you, this is not somebody... This is somebody that may be a reader that reads at home and they're trying to master. Yeah, because I'm hearing doppelganger for some of you, somebody that is trying to master your energy. They may watch your readings a lot. OK, so somebody is dealing. Somebody's going to end up dealing with a racist judge or something like that. Um, or this Somebody's not healed here. They made a judgment. The wrong, a wrong judgment call. Look, look, somebody, yeah, I don't know, somebody's child could pull a gun on someone, or someone's child put a gun on them, or you could have to pull a gun on your child, or this is happening to them, what is going on here, feelings are, your feelings are valid in reverse, this person definitely didn't pay attention to their feelings about this uh, person that they have a contract with they could be married to this person They're, yeah this high priest this male is under pressure here oh, principal action consequences yeah because whoever this high priest is high priest is they knew they had a contract with you this person kept you waiting too long now they're feeling pressure yeah you want this person to go to go away they, they this person was emotionally and mentally manipulative what is this past energy yeah this <laughs> So they held back. This person loved you. They went to something that was easy. This person may have been shocked knowing that they can't get in contact with you. You're not easily reachable. This person thinks that they can manipulate you with words, uh, do some sort of mind manipulation. Look, look, look. I'm lo I was looking at pressure, pressure, regret, shame. So this person feels shame and regret. Their uh, remorse, they need to own up to something that happened in the past here. What is this? Profound love. What is important? What is important to you? So this person wasn't willing to let go of this baggage, let go of this. For some of you, an underage minor that they get fellatio from. Could be someone's family member. Check out that reading. They, they pray together. Nourishment in reverse. Tell me more. So this person... Somebody was married in the past here to somebody that was faded. <laughs> Somebody's married to someone that's not healed, past life soulmate. This person could come from a family of races. They could be racist. You could have a family of racists or bigots. Okay. This is somebody is, um, this is a spirit, her spiritually 
immor immoral hater? What kind of, what is this? So some, a spiritually immoral hater. Somebody prejudged someone. Someone didn't do their research here. Okay. They, they take, they think they're taking calculated risk here. Somebody, yeah. Somebody's also giving out false reading. Somebody needs to do your research here about somebody that does collective readings. Okay. There, somebody may have put out some false information about a reader here, but this person is really racist or bigot. They're, they're not healed. For some of you, this is somebody that you had a past life uh, contract with. Somebody's definitely, um, they took a risk and it didn't pay off here. Somebody's not able to ascend because they have uh, too much baggage here with a new phone. Who this? This person could have tracked your phone or has something, especially if you have a, a, a you have recently got a phone or you may be thinking about getting a new phone. Somebody's taking a cast. Cal somebody took a calculated risk with someone that didn't nourish their soul. They had some sort of business arrangement with this person. What next? Plan, plot, bad advice, hidden enemy. We have the pickaninny, the conjurer of deceit. This is this is somebody's downfall, and it's in reverse. They could, this person could have played tricks and with this person's mind and said you were a part of it. But how could it, how could it be? When ever since this person came into your person's life, everything has went downhill. Right. I'm being told to end it here. What's there? Yeah, but first, bully suck. Somebody's about to get knocked duff around. Okay, by a hidden enemy. Surrender to now. Somebody need to surrender to now. They they sleeping with the enemy. Here, the Lord. Is they telling me the Lord of the spirits? This man. Take charge with authority. Somebody needs to be the captain of their own ship, okay? With surrender to creativity. This person was trying to steal someone's creative ideas, and it's somebody's destiny, somebody's calling, and it's not adding up. Like, the things that they're seeing is not adding up here. They're realizing it's not adding up. Somebody's not skilled enough. They don't know enough information. <clears throat> In my last reading, this card and this card was at the top, Right? You guys and gals did not see what was under the sun, this, the sun card, right? This is the, their way of saying this is applying to somebody that's watching this. Or this is a confirmation that, yes, okay, somebody's in de depression. In the last reading, this these were all up. I believe this came out. These were all up. Now they're in reverse, and this is the high priestess in reverse. I'm telling somebody is depressed because they can no longer take your create creative ideas. They can no longer like your energy signature is different. Okay. This person can also be using mirrors. This could be somebody that has mirrors. They do some sort of mirror spell. I'm hearing mirror, mirror on the wall. And that's not no disrespect to her because I'm hearing that. And I know who says that, and there's no disrespect to her. That I, I, I fucks with her. But this is a message for somebody. Okay? Maybe you have started doing scarring, and you are reflecting that negative energy back, and it's working. It's causing some sort of depression here because somebody's doing hypnotism spells. I'm just going to... I'm gone.